Welcome to this tutorial where we'll explore a smart way to sum values based on the selection of a drop-down list in Microsoft Excel. In this video, we'll delve into one powerful methods using data validation in Excel functions. Let's dive in and streamline your data analysis. We can do sum for a list or a range of values easily if we select all values together and then apply sum function in Excel. But if we only want to sum part of them based on the selection in a drop-down list, how can we do? For example, suppose we have two lists. One list records some fruits, and they can be duplicate in this list, the other list records the amount. If we create a filter on fruits and just pick one of them, how can we sum the total amount of this filtered fruit? Though we can calculate the total amount one cell by another cell, this is not very simple. So, in this free tutorial, we will introduce you a simple way, through a formula, to sum values based on the selection of drop-down list. Copy, fruit, column to another column first. For example, column D. On column D, click data in ribbon. Then click remove duplicate under data tools group to remove duplicate fruits from new fruit list. Remove duplicates, dialog pops up. Just click OK. Then you will notice that duplicate values are removed from column D. All fruits are unique. Add two new columns. Type select fruit in cell E1, and type total amount in cell F1. Select on E2, then click data to data validation under data tools group. On data validation window, there are three tabs. Click the first, settings, select, list, in allow drop-down list. Select equals $D2, $D9 in source text box. If you want to get some prompt message, you can click the second tab, input message, and enter title and message. Then click OK. Click on E2. Verify that, select fruit, message pops up. Select a fruit in drop-down list, for example, orange. In F2, enter the formula. Equals sum product. Sum if. Dollar a two dollars. Dollar a fourteen dollars. Dollar E two dollars. Dollar B two dollars. Dollar B fourteen dollars. Press enter and check the result. Verify that total amount for orange is calculated correctly. Select another fruit from drop-down menu. Verify that total amount is recalculated and updated properly. And there you have it. The above method will sum values based on the selection of a drop-down list in Excel. Whether you choose to use data validation or functions like SUMIF and SUMPRODUCT, these methods will help you gain valuable insights from your data. Thanks for watching.